Hello and welcome to chapter number 10. My name is Mohammad Amir and if you follow me along, you get a lot of tips about Photoshop CC. I am very excited about this tutorial because in this tutorial, you learn lot of things. And the major thing is in this chapter, you learn what is the difference between masking layers, what is the difference between rasterized layer and what is the difference between shape layers. If you are a premium member of amirproductions.com, you get the exercise file. So let's start. First open your Photoshop, I have already. This is Photoshop CC collection and uh, double click or you can control O and select this uh, model image. I don't know what is the name of this model but I got the picture from internet. Masking image, click here and click open. Now here is your image. For example, I want to remove this background. There is a lot of ways to remove background but I like masking. And then grab your quick selection tool and make a rough selection from this side. Yeah, that's good. But here is a problem. This hand is in selection. Hold down the Alt key and simply click and drag. And you can remove. And maybe from this side. Yep, that's good. But the problem is models here is too small not too much details inside and inside so what is the trick right click and then select inverse when you select inverse and you have select your magic quick selection tool or magic wine tool and you got this bar click refine edge and you see everything is hide but don't worry about that and then click and drag around here and now you will see it's a really a big magic you get your hairs back oh my god it's an amazing option that's look nice and maybe from this side yeah and maybe just a bit details and then hit ok and now it's time to make a mask just click on add layer mask icon click here and you'll see everything is hide but here is you can see you have two different uh, options this is the image this is the mask when you hold on the shift and click here you can disable your mask but again hold down the shift key and then click you will reactivate your mask make a new layer hold down the control key and click on add new layer icon because i want my layer under this layer or simply if you can click here and you got uh, your layer of, uh, on the top of this layer but i want to make my layer under this layer so simple trick hold down the control key and then click here now you get your link under this layer well alt backspace and fill your background with your foreground color and now you see your all detail is here but if you have any problem you believe your uh, some uh, thing like your uh, dress is cutting your hair is cutting your ears is cutting your face is cutting then for example here is a problem on this ear so the most big advantage of your masking uh, look at this uh, you have two colors white and black the black color means your things is hide and the white color means your thing is show so here is a simple trick go to brush tools by the way uh, b is the short key for this and I prefer always the short keys because short uh, keys make your work fast, fast and faster. Then black is top and simply paint. You can see your area is cutting. But when you click on this button or shortcut from keyboard is X, 
and your white is top and yeah, let me paint and you see your image is back so here is the big trick well guys i think you found this tutorial helpful my name is mohammed amir see you next time